Yeah, I'm in Gotham City in a Batmobile. Even though it get crazy, niggas don't talk like Swayze. Oh my God, where have you guys been? Uh, I'm back, guys. I'm off a vacation. I haven't even unpacked yet. Soon as I got through the door, I said I'm hopping on the mic. Because I need to talk to my peoples. I miss ya. I'm never going away for like nine days again, bruh. Five days is my limit. I've no I've just noticed that about myself. Five to six days is my limit. And I know some people's like, what are you talking about, Swayze? What are you talking about? You're on vacation. I need to get back to La Familia. I was going through withdrawals. And yeah, I was posting on the um the Instagram or whatever have you in the standard third. But what you gotta understand is this. My YouTube is my heart. That's my cool. It's the blood in my veins. La familia is the switch on the glock. La familia is the air I breathe. La familia is my heart, my love. I gotta get back. And we're back, baby. But I'm gonna tell it to you just like this. I'm going to tell it to you just like this. All of you people, all of you people that got a problem with me shouting out my donators in the beginning of the video because you're not a donator to the bacon, egg, and cheese fun, click off the video right now. I'm not going to even tell you where to skip to. And anybody who puts a timestamp inside of my comment section telling them where to skip to, I'm going to delete it. <laughs> I ain't going front. I don't think I'm going to be able to catch every time stamp. <laughs> Y'all got it. Y'all be quick with it. You know, y'all be quick with it. But look, 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 look. I've been going for a while. So listen to my new and reoccurring best friends. This might take a while. First up is the bro. You already know. Alex. And he says, for no more bacon, egg, and cheese from TGI Fridays, I'm eating mine at Cuban American Original. Miami. And oh, yeah, still away from Coco Felons. And big deal. <laughs> Thanks, Alex. I appreciate you, bro. You don't even know. You come through with just like this um wellspring of wisdom and knowledge. You got a good head on your shoulders. Pause! Hey, yo, what the yo, Swayze come. Swayze get off of um vacation and just start saying just like the most unsavory things next up is the legendary pokemon guys my brother from another mother holy cigarettes and he says hashtag free fetty wop np rgf island facts bro free the real one eye banded next up is dom and he says to get your morning bev that Arizona price is going up. Thanks, bro. I appreciate that. You know what I'm saying? Because the prices are going up. Next up is Melissa Thomas. Oh, oh. I'm going to tell y'all right now. Yo, yo, yo. Holy cigarettes. Holy cigarettes. And Alex, Melissa, Missy to me, Thomas pulled up. And if that's my Melissa that I know in that comment section that been here since the beginning, since the beginning, she was one of the few females within the comment section going crazy. Said, nah, what you talking about? Swayze knows what he talking about. Defending me, going crazy. She was like, she was like, she was like, what you talking about? Ain't nobody bigger than he. Ain't nobody bigger than Swayze. Swayze better. She was going crazy. Melissa, baby girl, I'm going to tell you right now. I'm going to tell you right now. You getting a shout out for the next three videos. The next three videos. She made sure your boy ate good on vacation. Shout out to Melissa. And last but not least, it's JJ Wolf. And he says, got to support the Beck Fund. Hope all is well. I appreciate you, bro. All is good, man. I was on vacation. I left everybody in the towns in the freezing cold. You already know. And I appreciate you, my guy. But if you, too, want to become one of Swayze's new best friends, you already know. Hit the cash app. I just sat here and just read cash apps. Hit the cash app. It's that simple. 
Now, I'm going to tell it to you just like this. Not a lot has been going on in the towns while I was gone. As it should. As it should be. However, you know, Shai K, a.k.a. Mr. Lord Jiggy, Lord Jiggy Hendrix himself, got in his feelings real quick. And it's all behind this OYOG's breakup. Now, look, it's been a little minute, so let me give you a recap. Some 150 side characters from Cortland says something about E. Dot. The OY niggas start saying that they smoking on they mans. Shy E.K. got in his feelings, you know what I'm saying? And this, that, and the third. But his whole thing was this. You know what I'm saying? He naughty bopping. He unfollowed all the Coco felons. He don't mess with the OYs, right? However, he is still standing on the fact that nobody should be smoking on E. Dot. Now, this is his whole thing. That's his, you know what I'm saying? That's his thing. That's what, he, that's what he's standing on. He's like, look, that's, what, that's what's going on. Ain't nobody going to be smoking on e Dot. You know what I'm saying? But I'm going to be smoking on e Dot's best friends. But now it looks like Shai K is on bad timing because, you know, I guess one of the side characters from 150 said something again about e Dot in total chaos. Assume. Now, after that, Shai K went on his stories, and he said, Y'all better smoke on E-Dot when y'all see me. Then he put up a picture of E-Dot, and he said, I'ma throw all this away for you. And last but not least, he says, My gun go. I put this on the map. Free the guys. I'ma be with them soon. Oh, no. What is Lord Jiggy Hendrix III talking about? See, I can understand the whole aspect of a gangster ain't scared to go to jail, but I don't think that they post, and he said in his stories, send the low, you'll be leaving after you take your videos. You not OYK. And he also said, I'm on my way. Now, I guess that was like um, either a lie or he did like pull up and Shai K wasn't there because uh, nothing came from it after that. But I'm here to say this, going out your way to go in your stories and say you gonna crash out so you could go and see the guys as well, crazy. And he was sweating on that live too. It's cold, it, it's cold in New York a little bit, you know what I'm saying? How you sweating outside? How you sweating outside? So I don't even know what's going on. These kids is outside with the macage, you know what I'm saying? The Marcleasy, sweating, talking about they gonna go to jail and they ready to be around a bunch of sausages, being told what to do, when to sleep, when to get up. No pooms around them. If you ask me, it sounds very, hey yo. But pull up in the comment section and let me know how you feel about the situation. And if you like the video, don't forget to share, subscribe to the channel if you're not already. And make sure you hit that, you know what I'm saying? Notification button. We back, baby. But I'm off this. Bro!